All right, we're joined now by Bethel head coach Penny Four and players Allie Fout Kilgore and Kayla Hokinson after a 4 3 nine inning victory over Central in the winner's bracket. Congratulations, ladies, on the victory. Uh, coach, your thoughts on, on just a really intense, well played game on both sides? Yeah, I, I, again, um, Central is, is so good and they've played great all year and have great defense and do such a good job running the bases and so we knew we had to come in prepared and I'm going to tell you my heart rate is still a little high right now. <laughs> well you fell behind 2 nothing early that's not a position you're used to being in. Talk a little bit about you know you're fighting back and staying in this game. Yeah one of the things that we've talked about all year is just is learning how to fight learning how to go through adversity and we can do hard things and and the, the hard the more that we do hard things the better that we're going to be at fighting back. Uh, you guys had three hits in the game, and Allie, you had all three of the hits. Three, uh, three, four, five on the game, including what turned out to be the game-winning run. What was clicking for you at the plate? Yeah, I don't know. First time I struck out looking at a pitch right down the middle, so that was not <laughs> super fun um, for me. And then after that, I was like, all right, this isn't happening again. What am I going to do different? And just um, put that on ball, was aggressive at the plate, and teammates came through and helped me out. Well, and you don't always have to hit it to get a hit to be a hero. Uh, Kayla, you had two flyouts, but they were both, you know, sacrifice flies that scored the tying run and the winning run. What was your approach there as you're trying to just keep your team in the game? Well, I knew that I didn't need to get a hit because we didn't have two outs. I just needed to put barrel on the ball, and I had uh, fast runners in scoring positions. We were set up for success, and so I just um, wanted to play a part and do my job, and yeah. Thankfully, I got a couple, <laughs> couple, couple good barrels, so yeah. Awesome. We'll start with Allie, then Kayla, you can follow up. Going into extras is nothing new for this team after playing in the 15-inning game in the regionals last year. Um, when you get into that eight, though, kind of does the pressure start to go up a little bit, do you feel? Yeah, I, I feel like kind of what you said, Austin, we were in this position last year, so it that helps a lot, I feel like. We're a very veteran team, so it even though it was a high pressure situation your heart rate could be really up and just everyone like tense it felt really just like i i was confident the whole time that we that we had it that we could do it so i feel like that experience made it um just made us a lot more comfortable in those high pressure situations yeah i definitely feel like like it just felt like we've been in that situation before and we know how to come back from that um we know what it takes we know that it plays it takes playing together as a team um and it doesn't need um, any particular like great amazing diving play or whatever it just needs a little pieces to come together and I think we did that really well today. Coach, a yeah. little bit of a slow start obviously a couple strikeouts early but what adjustments did this team make about the third or fourth inning to start getting base runners obviously about 12 base runners there through yeah. those last part or parts of the game just to execute on little things. Um, I think the biggest thing that we kind of talked about in the approach that we changed is um, picking picking pitches that we want to hit and just being more selective at the plate. And so when we started doing that, that's when we were able to get base runners on. And then last one for you, Coach. You know, uh, as you well know from last year, winning this game does not guarantee winning a regional. You came back from the loser's bracket a year ago in this situation. So trying to close it out tomorrow with, with another victory. Yeah, um, obviously, you know, winning the first one makes makes the road easier. But we still, whoever we face, these other three teams are playing great. And there were two great games yesterday, and I expect two more today. And so we're going to still have to come back on top of our game. All right, Bethel beat Central 4-3 in nine innings. Head coach Penny Four, Allie Fouth-Kilgore, Kayla Hokinson. Congratulations. Thanks for your time. Thank you.